Thank you so much for coming to this video. Before we start, I just wanted to let you know that I'm ill right now, so please ignore my voice. But this video is an overgrown Italian town which is valued at around 125,000. It includes three buildings that you can walk into one being a little cafe or pizza place, one being a little house, and one being a little laundry room with a shower inside of it. As you see here, there is washing up lines throughout the whole town, making it feel a little more cozy, I guess. But yeah, this is one of my favourite builds and just because I like the details in it and I didn't use a single wall to build this all the walls were built with basic shapes just so I can make them follow the pathway which is running through the entire town in here is a little pizza shop as you can see it's quite cozy with just some coffee cups on the table um, but yeah, it's a cafe or a pizza place. I couldn't really find any good details, so that's why they're pretty random details. But yeah, this is the cafe. This on its own is probably around 10 to 20k simply because of the basic shapes. Um, but here we've got a little alleyway with a little trash can and stuff like that, making it, I guess, makes it feel a more cozy. And on the right, we've got a little little mini house that you can't actually go inside but it's just for decoration over here is also another little alleyway with another trash can in it i also tried putting these walls at the end of all the alleyways just to make it feel more secluded i also decided to go with lots of different colors for the houses to make it kind of stand out i used the inspiration to this town but i couldn't really get it exactly um but italian towns often had quite a lot of color in it which i didn't really do that much color but i did try and change the color of the buildings around to try it and make that seem a little bit more accurate to actual italian villages um but yeah on the right here we have again a decoration house i made custom windows custom wall um custom wall cracks custom vines everything like that is all custom I also made these custom mini trees with the little, I'm not actually sure what they're called, the little like brush things. Um, yeah, and over here is the little mini house. All it has in it is a bed, a sofa, um, an oven, and a little kind of um, refrigerator there which you can get snacks out. So you can live in this house other than no shower needs, but there is a place that you can do those needs if you want. Um, also, just to let you know, this is just a tour, this isn't a speed build, however, if you do want a speed build for this, I did record it, and if you like it, and make sure to comment below if you like a speed build, and I'll release it sometimes this week. Down here... You have just like a little bit of decoration and you have another little tiny house which you can't go inside either. So you have this little place with a ladder that you can go on top of the roofs. This is me just for decoration um, and I feel it would be nice just so you can see the whole like on top of all the town basically. Yeah I also included some little street lights into it too, street lights and the whole thing just because I thought it would make it like stand out at night time because there isn't many lights in this build whatsoever. I also tried adding loads of vines to make it look overgrown and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, over here is a little campsite and a wishing well as well. That was probably my favourite part of the wishing well. I spent quite a while trying to figure out how I was going to do it. I used references from Google and Pinterest and I got this in the end, which I really like the look of. I really wanted to add water in it as well, but I just couldn't because it's obviously a really weird shape but I did add a rock in the bottom of it that is painted blue just to kind of make it seem a bit like water not exactly but yeah over here we've got more plants and also a washing line where people can put their clothes etc this again is just for decoration as is with most most things inside this build over here we've got another trash can and a bench where you can relax in this town over here is the washing room. It's quite small, but there is four machines in there. There is two dryers and two actual washing machines, as well as a shower. So this is where everyone in the town can come and use it, for example. 
And yeah, there's loads of these walls throughout the build, which... Yeah, that's basically the build. I also couldn't really do windows. I could have if I wanted to, but I feel like they would have taken way too long, so I just made custom ones. But yeah, once again, I hope you all enjoyed this tour, and I will now be doing a tour with all the subscribers. So make sure to stay if you want to see them in it, and just see what it's like with actual people walking through the town. And let me know in the comments if you would like a speedboard of this, and I will release it basically as soon as possible. But thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all enjoy the rest of this video. Sorry if I waffled with that, I don't often speak one-on-one -on -one with the microphone really in recordings. And apologies for my voice, I've been ill for like over a week, and so hopefully that goes away soon. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching, and enjoy the rest of the video. pictures in my mind Got the sun in my hair, blue in your eyes I could lay here all my life Time over slowly, green goes from my heart I can't get enough of you Baby, it's the love for me Said that it's the me for you You know how to make me feel pretty Give it your time, it's more than I ask and receive 